Uh, what do you want? A mamba burger, mamba burger, please. We'll take a number seven with extra lies, please. Welcome to Watch Mojo's Top 5 Myths, the series that finds the biggest myths that people actually believe and dispels them one by one. This here is an advanced patty control mechanism. Here you can see our automated money handling system. Don't touch. These are your high quality beverage temperature devices. Imported. In this installment, we're looking at the five myths about fast food that had us hungry for the truth. That'll be four bucks, baby! You want fries with that? Myth number five, fast food never goes bad. For reasons not fully clear, many fast food consumers believe that mass-produced quick bites like burgers and fries are loaded with so much preservatives that said food will never decay. Grade A ground beef, meaning we dropped it on the ground. Louise, are we done here, Hugo? While it is indeed true that most fast foods are loaded with enough industrial chemicals to push back the expiration date for weeks, the notion that they're immortal for consumption is as false as it gets. While there are several variables that factor into any given food's longevity, including the obvious volume of preservatives present in each meal, all foods, fast or otherwise, eventually decay into inedible territory. Save it, me! Shut up. <laughs> You eat Shut up! Myth number four, fast food is cheap. Would you pay the same as what a Krabby Patty costs? Hmm, huh. sure, I suppose so. How about double? Now you're talking! Due to clever marketing and bait tactics like McDonald's dollar menu, a good majority of us have been led to believe that fast food is a steal. Million dollar menu! The dollar menu! I said fuck a dollar we menu! Off that million dollar menu! While most fast food chains certainly offer bargain menus and dishes matching dine-in establishments for less, the idea that they're more economically friendly than a homemade meal is nothing short of a falsehood. This bite is better than the previous bite! Gluten! The reality is, what one can cook up at home can not only be far more healthier, but also far more affordable. Case in point, the average price that a family of four would spend at McDonald's runs approximately at 35 US dollars. At home, that same family could have made a more filling and healthier chicken dinner for half, if not a third of that price. So no KFC? This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare and I can't wake up! Myth number three, fast food restaurants use these controversial ingredients. There's a rumor you make your burgers with human remains from the crematorium next door. <laughs> Given the immense thickness of McDonald's shakes and other dairy dessert products, these were a string of notions that didn't sound too far-fetched. Sounds like a hoopla! Hoopla! Rest assured, however, the rumor you heard, whichever variation, is false. McDonald's frozen treats are not in fact made of pig fat, cow eyeballs, or bird feathers. Yeah, that got around somehow. But are indeed using real, albeit pre-made, dairy mixtures. God damn, it's a pre fing good milkshake. Also, McDonald's isn't the only one accused of using false ingredients as a business practice. One myth suggesting that Taco Bell's beef is only 35% meat was dispelled by the company itself. So the next time you hear one of these extravagant rumors like pink goop in chicken nuggets, take it with a grain of salt. We don't know what it is or where it came from, but it has nothing to do with our chicken McNuggets. Myth number two, salads are healthy menu alternatives. It doesn't exist. <laughs> Healthy food is for suckers. It tastes like garbage, and if you say you like it, you're a chump and a liar. They're made mostly of vegetables. What harm could they possibly do to our health? Well, perhaps more harm than one might think, depending on what exactly is in the salad. No, we don't just mean the additional chicken. Who orders a salad from a burger joint? You watching your figure there, sweetheart? <laughs> what, are you gearing up for swimsuit season? <laughs> We're also talking about the fact that most salad alternatives at fast food establishments are loaded with so much cheese, dressing, and oils that they're just about as bad as one's standard burger and fries. Here you go, two salads. Ew, gross, those aren't salads. Take those back, remove the bun, the patty, and the condiments. But that leaves just lettuce and tomato. Exactly! In fact, studies show that some salad options can actually be less healthy than the standard meat dishes at most fast food establishments. Myth number one, fast food makes you fat. Okay, well you should sue McDonald's, because they f***ed you up, alright? Whether most of us care to admit it or not, it's not the fault of the fast food industry that contributes to our bulkiness. And even if that were the case, it's kind of on the consumer that they continue to purchase such foods. The fact remains that fast food alone does not and cannot lead to one becoming overweight. While it's true that one's diet is indeed a major contributor to their physical health, factors such as genetics, metabolical rates, and the obvious exercise, or lack thereof, are equally crucial components that weigh in on one's weight. 
One more good shake. Good, good. Keep them coming. Um, dude, don't you think you've had enough? So while we certainly don't endorse this diet, one could actually eat fast food every day and maintain a fit figure, provided they're in the right age range and do as much output as they do input. Hello darkness my old friend, I've come to talk with you again. So how many of these myths did you eat up? Some, some lettuce? No, that's it. What's that? That's it. Thanks. Okay, that's good. That looks delicious. For more supersized top 5s and top 10s with no filler, be sure to subscribe to watchmojo.com.